Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Project Ozone. And you may notice I have a improved jetpack. I've been doing a lot of grinding between episodes. So I got it up to the vibrant tier and then I armored it of course. Uh, we still don't generate enough power but I've also gotten some mechanism stuff. That's the only part that's not in the chest over here. But all of this stuff is related to the quests. Which, we've got a lot of quests with uncollect rewards. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's start with this one, because that one's all by its lonesomes. Reward bag. And of course, we've got... I haven't got to that yet, because we need a few things from some other quests. But we've done that. Got the electrical steel one, the energetic alloy one. Vibrant alloy, which is what we're wearing. Okay. And that's all of those ones. And through here, we've done a fair amount of work. We've got our nullifier. Metallurgic infuser. Ooh, we get two basic circuit control circuits and some enriched alloys. We've got all of these basic machines and stuff built. Uh, you need four of those advanced generators, which we don't ha haven't had the resources to make just yet. But we do have the enrichment chamber completed. And we've got the quarry from Buildcraft assembled. Alright, let's see. The tier 2 solar panel, we did that as well. We got the induction smelter. And we got the magma crucible. And we have the fluid transposer. And we also got the crucio stuff done. Alright. I got started on this. I've got the gold spikes and the vacuum hopper. We haven't had enough diamonds to do the diamond one. And that gets us a grinder. Alright, let's put some stuff away. Put that in there. We'll put that in there for now. Reward bags. Basic, good, and greater. Right. And we've got that a few times. We've got that before. We've got that before. Molten glass. Okay. Walrus. Some wall right and some elevators. Let's see, I think we got walrus in there. We got plenty of elevators. Um, let's stick those in there. Grab our chisel out because it's just chiseled dirt. Do I have a spot for dirt? Yes. You see? Yes, I know, it just said Blood Moon Rising. Apparently, in this pack, when it was made, they turned off the thing where you can't sleep. Unique to this pack. Alright, let's get our good bags. More lava generators. Aerial faith plates and some erothium. Golden balls. We've got that before, too. All right, let's see. Um, out of this stack, okay. That does not. And I put the generators somewhere else. Because I'd actually been using those. Ah, they are in there, okay. All right, six more bags to go. More dirt. More wire. Runic blocks? I wonder what mud those are from. Oh, twilight blocks. There's some more diamonds which we need. More magical wood and more dirt. Before we get too carried away, let's chisel our dirt. Nope. Not that chest. This chest. 
Alright, and now we got way more stuff than we could possibly use. <sighs> nah. Could swear I had that before. Wow. <laughs> we might have a little bit. Alright, let's see. What could we do today? Now that we've got all that completed. <coughs> well, I was actually thinking we could start... I, w I was looking up this, and we can't quite get there yet because we need a few other things. I was thinking we could work on some of that magical crops armor, perhaps. But we need diamond armor to get there. So, let's see how our diamond supply is. Four. Plus the diamond horse armor. If we can find it. If you run that through like a pulverizer, it'll give you diamonds. I forget which thing it is. Oh, <laughs> it's craftable too. Alright, how about uses? You can get five diamonds out of it exactly. Okay, let's see. Pulverizer. Where did I... <sighs> Where did I stick the pulverizer? Ow. Not enough to get us a full set, but we have our jetpack as well. Let's see. We've got a helmet and some boots. Because that is all we have the resources for. Alright, let's see. We have 48 of that. Hmm. Poor Crucio. Yes, 16 Akio. Alright. Oh, iron and gold. Alright, we got iron for days. I mean, when I say we've got iron for days, I mean, I've been converting it into the gravel and the dust blocks. Because uh, we've been doing some serious sieving, too. Stack of that, stack of that. We'll start with that. A stack of that. An Akio helmet. 84% damage reduction. Like that. Ah, that goes at the bottom. The Draconic stuff requires it at the top. Oh, wrong, wrong, wrong item. No, you can't fly with that. How do how do we look? Oh, jeez, that's hideous. All right, there's part of that complete. We just don't have enough diamonds to keep going. I think we got diamonds in the nether. More diamond ore. And this one shots zombie pigmen, so when they get angry, we can just kill them. Diamond hunting, we will go. Um, also, between episodes, I went and located a nether fortress. Ow. Ow. Owie. Ahoy. Oh, perfect. Perfect time for you to freeze there. There you are. Oh, come on now. One hit kill. Diamond door might not be readily... Uh, Skyberry bush. That's not what we want. Nope, not that. There's more bushes. Ooh, some draconium. I think I will. Nope. Well, anyways. More of those stupid spiders. Um, Portal right there. 
Yeah, we have no sounds. It's just what I've always wanted. Like that. Eh. Ow. Ow. Owie, owie. Now let's head back to the overworld. I was hoping we could find some, but apparently we're not going to. Oh, also, I have had animals spawn over there, and once again, I've heard somebody who didn't, doesn't understand what Nimbon was saying. Nimbon was saying. <sighs> Poison, nether bricks, and some kew. All of this stuff goes in a chest. It's frustrating to me that they're not getting what he actually said. They don't. The, the algorithm looks for the highest block and chunk, and then that's where it will spawn stuff. It doesn't start at the bottom because if it started at the bottom, it would spawn things in blocks all the time, and they would suffocate and die because they're inside of a block. <sighs> yeah, it's over there. Crucio Ho. The primary reason why that isn't as fast is because there's just not a whole lot of blocks there. We need to go expand that a lot. Let's see. Plop of Nisio. La la la. I think we have enough uh, dirt to do some expanding on it. So. And let's hit F7 first before we get too carried away because. Well, death is not a desired outcome. Alright, let's grab our wand, and uh, we'll probably want the watering can as well. If we have enough dirt to complete this, but we'll give it a shot. Two. Ah, good. We do have enough dirt for that. Now let's go grab some cobble. I'm going to take a quick nap so it's daylight out. Come on. All right, and we'll finish that up. So we start with uh, the 
go ahead and get our edge around. This will help. It. Uh, we have had several new fluid cows. I've been uh, putting the fluid cows into safari nets and then killing everything else, basically. Let's see, watering can, spreader grass. La, 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 da, da, da. I don't think that would work in real life, but yeah, it helps uh, grass spread. And, and sometime along the ways, I do plan to get the mechanism wind generators going for our starting power. I find that tends to be one of the better ones. I still am not sure how we're going to get Skystone at the moment. Um, but we need it to get to the mining dimension. Uh, because that's what you need for the mining tool. Uh, not by default, they tweaked the recipe to make it harder but some sort of logs and the rest of this we've all we are uh the rest of all this we can do but we just can't do the sky stone right now in any event i do hope you enjoyed the video if you did do be sure to hit that like button and if you really enjoyed it you can click on the little picture of my guy's face on the screen to subscribe and you can also check out some of the other videos of mine on screen as well and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.